A new program in West Lafayette aims to help the city go green and help homeowners save on their water bill. It all has to do with rainwater and a barrel. News 18's Dustin Grove explains how it works. When it rains, it goes in here till it fills up and then it comes out through the regular downspout. From his front yard in West Lafayette, Bill Evers is showing us an ancient practice being revived in a growing number of homes. We started with one, liked the way it worked, and um, took it from there. Rain barrels. There's two, two out front and we got uh, two in the back. Connected right to the downspouts. The Evers family uses them to keep water away from their house and the water captured is used in place of city water. Waters the flowers, so instead of turning on our city water, we get this 200 gallons worth of water. Which saves on their water bill. The city calls it a good idea. Rather than uh, running up your water bill, watering lawn, flower beds, garden, whatever, um, using what's falling from the sky, capturing it and making use of it, that's uh, been done for <laughs> a long time. Utility director Dave Henderson says these barrels also help communities cut down on water pollution. By each barrel capturing rainwater, it cuts down on combined sewer overflow into the Wabash River after a big storm. The more residents use them, uh, the bigger impact. Which is why the city is now offering rain barrels to its residents for $25. City workers will even deliver them. From Ever's perspective, we we learn more about it, and it, it seemed like a, a really positive way to help. In West Lafayette, Dustin Grove, News 18. The barrels are offered to residents at a lower cost thanks to a grant facilitated by the Wabash River Enhancement Corporation. If you are interested, call the West Lafayette Wastewater Treatment Utility. The City of Lafayette has offered a similar program to its residents for several years, now through Water Pollution Control Department.